Yeah, yeah, you already know what it is, man. Salute to every one of y'all out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa. You know what's crazy? Nobody's really talking about Ace I Mean versus Rum Nitty. Bro, yo, Ace I Mean, uh, do you know what you're getting into? And he's very conscious and cognitive of what he has going on in his career. So y'all jump in the comments and let, let him know how you feel about the battle. You know, congratulations to Ace I Mean for getting on Summer Madness, I must say, because he had to work to get there. You know what I'm saying? Like, he had to grind. He had to promote. That nigga was doing videos. He was backing up down the street. Man, was in the gym. He was eating Popeye's biscuits. Like, he was working to get on this card. There are a lot of people who are not on there that people are questioning, like, where's Danny Myers? Where is Swamp? Et cetera, et cetera. So, Ace, you are in a privileged position. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got the nod. You got the call. You was a bubble team. Like, in the NCAA tournament, they had a little bubble teams that be almost at the bottom that might not make it in. Boom, 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 boom. But you got there. You know what I'm saying? Off of your hard work, off of your battles, whatever the case may be, I felt like you definitely had some better looks this year and you've been a little bit more consistent. Now, you still do have, you know, slippity blippities there here and there. You know what I'm saying? I know the true foe battle was an ugly look for both of y'all. You know what I'm saying? I didn't like that battle, but you know, you had more after that and you got busy and that's the thing. You know what I'm saying? Like as long as you progressing and you growing, I'm like, all right, it's cool, but you're battling somebody who I gave a new nickname, Possible 30, because every single battle that Rum Nitty has could be a Possible 30. I could argue a Possible 30 against anybody. I can even argue a Possible 30 with him against you. Hmm? 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 Yeah, yeah, I could argue that. That's true. I could really argue that he's going to possibly 30 you up there in Houston. Hmm? What are you, what, what you going to do that's going to show us that you're going to beat somebody like uh, Ace Amin? You know what I'm saying? Like, 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 like Ace I mean, how you gonna beat somebody like Rum Nitty? Uh, <clears throat> I'll say this. Uh, the talent is there. I've always liked Ace I mean from the beginning. You know what I'm saying? I always said from the beginning of his uh, battles that if he could keep himself out of trouble and like stay in battle rap and stay focused on battle rap, he could have some very good performances like he did versus gyms. You know what I'm saying? And I'm just talking about specific joints that he did. Like he really did have some good performances and he continued to grow. And with you are in a space now of needing a new star or needing somebody that's going to step to the forefront and be one of their for like star battle rappers. It's a prime opportunity for you right now. You know what I'm saying? Like your opportunity is right now. Please don't think that, oh, if Summer Madness goes, you know, wacky, I could, I'll be back. I'll show y'all, I'll show y'all in November. No, this is your show right now. You'll still battle, you'll still do your thing, but your moment to make history or your moment to really, really have a good performance would be now. Especially with the card versus card thing. You got all these leagues doing their thing. Every single battle on this card is going to need some work. It's going to need some fireworks. You know what I'm saying? Like somebody going to have to make a memorable moment. Will it be you? Because I know Rum Nitty not playing. Rum Nitty bringing it against everybody. Did you see him versus Oppa? Did you see him versus? Oh, okay. I went to get the court. I picked the nickel up and got mad. Oppa's really nice too. And he got Geechee Gotti coming up too. Oppa has Geechee Gotti coming up. That card is going to be I battle. Lex Luthor, I don't know what y'all doing over there. I don't know if it's petroleum, if y'all niggas got oil money. I don't know what's going on over there, but it's looking crazy. Like, they got that that, that car, Oppa versus Geechee, and then you got Feeble versus Tay Rock. Tay Rock's been on them. Let's just keep it moving. So, um, Rum Nitty is just, is just a, a alien, a monster, and the flips that he's going to have on you, they're, they're pulling out the ace. Like, oh, my goodness. Like, he's going he's gonna to be wilding, man. I really, really sincerely hope that you are more than prepared for what is coming your way. Now, I don't got no doubt. I don't have a doubt, Ace, I mean, you know what I'm saying? But the, the Rum Nitty kick ass. <laughs> he don't play around, and we know what he going to bring. Small stage, big stage, we know what he going to bring. You know what I mean? And, and he was the last one on the card, like really kind of put on the card last. Like y'all and then the disaster and real sick. And I've seen all the reactions to the disaster and real sick. But like I said, all's fair and warfare. I'm not mad. I right, yeah, listen. People be thinking that the bloggers be really like mad at cards or trying to like no 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 no. I want summer madness to be good. 
the more they the more they burn, the more we earn. Make it good. I want the card to be good. I want them to have all good battles. I want memorable moments. I want punches. I want all of that. Get to it. Get to it. Do not think that there's anybody out there who wants to go recap a bunch of bad battles. Because it's not even interesting at that point. When you're recapping bad battles, you it, it's not even fun. You just get bored. Like It's not even really a good thing. When you got to do like bar breakdowns for everything and SPs in his bag, that's when it's fun. Because it's like, yo, it's just so much work to do. But when you just like, oh, man, I ain't even writing nothing down, man. The third round, blah, blah, blah. Like, it's just, it gets boring, you know what I'm saying? And even in what we do, it can get boring if stuff is not popping. But what I will say is uh, Rum Nitty's going to bring it, man. <laughs> How do I feel about it so far? I mean, I'll talk about it more in depth with Showtime SP, but I just want to get this message out there early. Uh, I do have Rum Nitty winning 2-1. I mean, I'm going to be honest. I got 2-1. Hey, his name's possible 30. Huh. I ain't say the 2-1 or with the 2-1, you know what I mean? Like, a 2-1 is like, it's like almost guaranteed money. Like, it's really hard to beat Rum Nitty in two rounds. Like, if we really get to thinking about it, like, how many niggas have really beat Rum Nitty in two rounds? Whew. Man, that's tough. One of the only real shockers that I have is a uh, uh, Reed Dollars. You know what I'm saying? I feel like Briz. I don't want to murder no more. It took one of his best performances ever to have a uh, have an arguably good battle with, with Rum Nitty. Rum Nitty don't be fucking losing, bro. Check that nigga's stats on that app. That nigga got to be like 23 and 4 or some crazy shit like that. His numbers is crazy. He do not be losing. That nigga don't lose. He don't lose. So, possible 30. <laughs> it could be one. I'm just saying. It could be one. Write in the comments what y'all think. I want to know how y'all calling it because it really ain't even about me. It's more so about y'all and this is all about, uh, con uh, you know what I'm saying, content. Just to talk about what we think. But yeah, I think it could be one. Possible 30. <laughs> Possible. It, it is very well in the, in the, um, in the realm of possibilities. But uh, Ace, I mean, he will have the fact that they're going early. You know what I'm saying? Like that's a battle that you know is pretty much going to be like one of the first joints of the night along with real sick and disaster i do think real sick is just more so catered to like a url crowd like i'm not even hating on Diz. you know what i'm saying like it's just whenever Diz has been on url it ain't really been like that you know what i mean like i can't even remember recently in, in recent memory a performance that he had that was kind of like fire you know what i'm saying on url now maybe this is the one you know what i mean but he got a lot going on, so, you know, you're going to see, you know, he got Battle of the Bay shit that just dropped, and I know a lot of people are trying to get at him saying, you know, the, the way that he got on the card, like, was he an ins was it an inside job? Was this the inside man? I, I mean, you know, the the, the marketing was kind of catered towards easy. I think he said something about it the other day, too, that the whole marketing was going against him and shit, but it is what it is. When you make yourself that guy, you know, he know, he know when you make yourself the enemy of the state, you got to get whatever comes on the plate, my man. So <laughs> you trying to burn their house down. They trying to burn your house down, too. You niggas better have some fire insurance is all I'm saying. Um, but, yeah, I like Ace I mean, uh, I like the fact that, you know, he's 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 stepping into that leadership role. Uh, you know, he's on the summer madness. Like, you know, I mean, people could say that it's a million battle rappers. I don't even think 400 could say they've been on summer madness. I know. No, hell no. It can't be no 400 might be about 250 people ever that could say they was on that card so that's of us of some prestige i must say uh yeah i will be watching the joint i ain't gonna let you i ain't even gonna hold y'all i ain't one of the people that, oh i ain't copping it yes i am i am copping it we will be watching it we will be recapping it and i hope that they do good you know what i'm saying like for real i want to see rock versus av like rock versus av i want to see or, or is t top and john john how far are they gonna go you know i know they cool in real life are they really gonna Jump over the edge, you know what I'm saying? Hollow versus um, Twerk. I think that's probably going to be the battle of the night, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's all, <laughs> for me, I think that is the one that people really need to look at. But, yeah, that Ace I mean versus uh, Rum Nitty, man. Y'all let me know, man. Like, for real, jump in these comments. You let me know what your thoughts are on this good, good Sunday, man. But uh, salute to every single one of y'all out there. Uh, shout out to my brother Showtime SP. We was at the Giants game the other day. You know, he's trolling, talking his eagle sh in Giant Stadium. You know what I mean? Like, what's wrong with this guy? But nah, shout out to my brother, man. You know what I'm saying? We had a good episode with Goods the other day that will be dropping real soon. And we got two other episodes that we did where we talked about a lot of shit going on in Battle Rap, the cards, et cetera, et cetera. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to the network for keeping us in business. You know what I'm saying? There's good people over there. They always want to see us do good. You know what I'm saying? We've been getting better 
with our chemistry because chemistry is like everywhere else you know what i'm saying like when you do it in your personal studio y'all like this that and the third but when you gotta go somewhere else and it's all type of different cameras looks you know what i'm saying and you gotta really be focused it's a little different you know what i'm saying because none of us has really done that type of stuff before but overall it's been a pretty fun experience you know what i'm saying whenever we go up there we get treated very well you know what i'm saying and it, it is what it is you know what i'm saying i know some people be like oh y'all show it too much y'all talk about it it's like dog it's historic nobody's done that before and it might not get done again you know what i'm saying so you got to kind of encompass that and enjoy it while you can you know what i'm saying there's a lot of people out there who are um proud of and love what we're doing so you know what i'm saying again like i said we thankful for you bitch ass niggas on a sunday no nah, i'm just playing but uh take care you already know bang bang